What is a stair tread overhang? Well, in this picture here, the circle provides you with a perfect example of what the overhang is. It's the area that protrudes past the face of the stair riser. It's usually going to be an inch long. Now you will also run into cases where you won't have a riser like this picture here. Um, however, you will have the face of the stringer um, where the riser would have nailed on that could be considered the overhang. And of course, here's a carpeted stairway with the stair tread um, overhang carpeted. And of course, that is normally why they have an overhang is, I shouldn't say that normally, the reason why they have overhangs are to provide you with a little more area on the top of the stair step to um, actually stand on as you're walking up. So if you could imagine one inch less on this particular stairway, um, you, someone with larger feet might have a problem walking up the stairway. It won't be as comfortable as it would be for someone with smaller feet. Now here's a picture of a stairway without an overhang. It's a concrete stairway and you can see that there is nothing, absolutely nothing protruding from the face of the riser um, or the top of the tread. Um, this is just a regular stairway without an overhang. Now here's something you, some stair builders might consider this stairway to have an overhang. Um, realistically, I don't because there's nothing that it would be overhanging from. So um, I wouldn't consider this to have an overhang. An architect might design a stairway and um, suggest that there be an overhang, a one inch overhang on a stairway like this. Um, and of course, the stair builder would build it um, accordingly. But most of the time for something like this, I wouldn't consider this to be an overhang. Again, a stair tread overhang would be the area of the stair tread or the stair step that protrudes past the stair riser.